Hey everybody, Aaron here. Welcome back to another anime review. Today we are looking at Sakurada Reset Episode 5. So, this is the first thing I'm going to post to all of you guys. I put on Twitter, so follow me on Twitter if you don't already. Uh, do you guys want me to continue reviewing this? Because honest to God, I was defending the show strongly for the first few episodes. I was like, oh, you know, there's some really cool elements to it. Uh, it has some interesting story arcs. It, it, it seems like it could be something very interesting and dark, as we saw from last week's episode, which was a decent episode. Um... But I'll be honest with you, too often I'm watching this show and noticing one of two things. One, I'm not getting a lot of views for the videos. They're not doing too bad per se, but they're not getting a lot of views. So it's like, I know people aren't really caring about the show too much. And two is the fact that these these episodes are kind of hard for me to review for the sheer fact that nothing happens. It's, it tends to be very easy to explain of how boring this show is when it, when all I have to do is say... Again, this week, we have the main characters, and they solve a case where this girl's trapped inside of a marble because she's able to project herself into an alternate world because she's been feeling lonely and depressed, and yeah, that's that's it. They figure out a way of saving her at the end. That's what the review was. It's an okay episode. When I have to review an episode like that, because that literally was what I could do for this episode, and that's probably all I'm going to say about this week's episode, that's a problem in itself. So, I feel like I'm going to ask you guys, really, go vote on Twitter, or at least put in the comments below, tell me, do you want me to keep going with this show? You know, it's not that I don't particularly hate this show, I don't make it sound like I'm, I'm hating the show, but it's one of those shows that I really can't review, it's too, nothing happens, you know, it's too simple for me to review, because it's just like, okay, this week's episode, this happened, the end. And as I just gave you guys, it's that's a problem. That really makes reviewing something very difficult for me because, you know, one of the big differences between written review and, you know, video review. In a written review, I can go through every little detail. It's kind of a mixture of synopsis and, of course, how, my, how I felt about the episode. Versus a video, it's me regurgitating the same thing as a written review, but minus the fact that it's not as detailed because, obviously, I'm not going off of pen and paper. I'm actually going off my own, you know, mind and actually what I remember from the episode. The problem with that is, is that it makes it where the whole review is reliant on my emotions during the episode. So if I want to go into detail about an episode, you know, it, it has to have a lot of action, has a lot of uh, interesting mystery elements. It has to have something that really propels me talking about that episode where I can give you guys detailed description of the episode or give you guys a detailed uh, thought about the episode or kind of go into analysis about it. In an episode like this or even a show like this, you know, every other episode has that hit or miss moment where, like last week's episode, I was able to go into a lot of detail with because we had a lot of cool stuff happening. The week before that, however, it was a mixed bag. And the week before that, it was also a mixed bag of, of stuff I can give you guys. But it's something that I don't like reviewing stuff that, first off, like I said, I know it's not very many views are getting on this. It's not because just me not putting it out on time, obviously, because there are some some reviews I put out hours after they're, they've aired and they do particularly fine. But... You know, it's the thing is, if I don't really see a, really anyone caring about it, I really can't gauge if you guys even like the review. But even more so is the fact that I can't give a good review for you guys, and that's a problem with me too, because I don't want to do that for you guys. I don't want to make a video that's half-hearted or half-assed, because that is insulting you guys and not really doing my job when it comes to doing this. So, like I said before, and I said this before uh, twice right now, so I do apologize, but I just want to give you guys, in case you skip to the end or something like that, you know, follow me on Twitter. Go vote there because I'm going to have the, the poll up for one day. That's the fate of Sakura's reset. Now, one of two things will happen. If that doesn't, you know, if that votes towards a yes where you don't, you guys don't want me to vote it, uh, review it anymore, I should say. What I will be doing is I will still be reviewing Bar Baruto as long as I want to for the most part. But I will also be doing like a random review like the old days or maybe an anime talk or maybe, you know, a, a device corner video, whatever. It'll be, it'll be something in that slot instead in the middle of the day. And that would be easier for me because all I could do is just have a video pre, pre set up already and just launch it on a Wednesday instead of having it delayed. I can actually do it on my, you know, scheduled time of like 3.30 in the uh, afternoon. If it keeps going, of course, obviously I will keep reviewing Sakura's Reset and I'll just keep doing it like normal for the most part. Uh, just mind you though, the reviews might be hit or miss because obviously I can't put in a lot of effort into something that's very lackluster to begin with. Anyways, guys and girls, I hope you, you know, don't mind this kind of quick review, even though the timer says so much so long. It's, it really wasn't a very eventful episode. It was a lot of narrative, a lot of dialogue between the characters, which wasn't that great. It was very boring, but I mean, it was interesting, the concept of her power, but that was it. You know, it wasn't that great of an episode. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great blessed day, everyone. Oh, 
for you guys now probably night. So have a great, blessed night. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.